Where are you coming from, young lady? I... Answer me. I was with my friends. You did not return home last night. Go ahead. What other excuse do you have for her now? Please, can you just be calm? So the neighbors don't hear us, please. Really? Is that all you can say? You have to stop now, please. You spoiled this girl so much. This girl is unmanageable. Her wildlife is, 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 is beyond her age. Excuse me, you're not my dad. So don't act like one. Muna, stop. Can you hear that? You always side him. Always. Muna, we're only doing what's best for you. Best for me? Yes. Has anyone ever asked me what I want? Have you? I don't even think you know what you want. Oh. Well, I know what I don't want. And I don't want you. Muna, stop. You know what? Come here. Baby. Just. I'm taking you right inside that room. You will stay there until we decide what to do with you. I'm follow not me. Kidding. You can't ground me. Just follow, follow me. Yeah. Follow. Yeah. Come. Yeah. Follow me. Gideon, 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 stop! You're hurting her! Gideon, 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 please now, just talk to me. Please. Please talk to me now. What's with the attitude? Huh? Okay, you know what? I promise I won't yell. Let's just talk. Your food is on the table. You've equally refused to eat. Are you still mad at us? I want to visit Dad. Do you hate me? No, I don't. I just want to be with Dad. It's been four years I last saw him, Mom. We only want what is best for you, Mona. He hates me. He doesn't like me. He finds fault in everything I do, Mom. Everything. Are you talking about your stepdad? Because he loves you. He takes you as his own. He only wants you not to do something you end up regretting. Oh, yes. He does it really well, Mom. Can you just stop with the sarcasm, please? Just whatever. But Mom, don't you think it's time? time for I mean this time yesterday you were not thinking about this so what changed I, I don't know that has been reaching out to me he has been wanting to see me but I wasn't I just I wasn't ready to see him but, but now I think I am Are you sure of this? Yes, Mom. Yes. Is this what you really want? Yes, Mom. Please. Okay. I'll put a call across to him. But this is going to be awkward. I mean, it's been four years. Are you sure you really want to do this? Do you need time to think about this? Well has to happen at some point. 
Yes. Are you sure. Do you need time to think about this? No, Mom, I'm, I'm sure I'm ready to see him. Okay. Fine. I love you, Mom. Thank you. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> My naughty girl. Hey, Gucci. Nice to hear from you again. Namdi, I'm going to be very quick about this. Anyways, how are you? I'm fine. And you? Mona? Everybody is fine. Mona wants to come over. Is that okay? Okay. She's ready? She wants to reconnect with her father. Is it a good time? Yeah, sure. It, it's a good time. All right, then. I'll talk to Gideon about it. All right. Um, when does she want to come? I mean, as soon as possible. Like tomorrow. Tomorrow? What's wrong? Uh, no, 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 nothing. Nothing is wrong. Um, yeah. I will just go and prepare her room. Are you sure it is a good time? No, it's fine. It's fine. Um, it'll be good to see her again after four years. All right. Take care. Bye. Spend some time with her father for like a week. Hmm? You heard me now. Mona will be going to spend time with her father for like a week. You've already decided what to do, so what do you want me to say? Baby, let's not fight about this. Hey, come on. Who's fighting me? I'm, I'm just saying. I, you left this man for a reason. Do you think it's to your best interest leaving her there alone? Are you fully aware that both of you don't get along? That man is my dad. Mona. And I don't need your permission. Mom, didn't you hear him? Stop. Enough, Mona. Don't talk to your dad that way. Hey. I know we're young, naive, and we made mistakes. Okay? Yes, he treated me badly. Yes, we fight all the time. But it doesn't excuse the fact that he's Muna's father. I'm going upstairs. Can't you talk about this? Please, let her go. Don't worry, I'm going to talk to him. He will agree. <laughs> I, I care what he thinks. He's not my dad. Mom, help me here now. You see what I'm going through? Please okay. talk to her. I don't know what to do again. Okay, I will talk to her. Hello? Well, I'm just calling to him. Ensure that you know that I'm bringing Muna tomorrow. Of course, I remember. <clears throat> Anything? Um, hey, and also, um, what does she like to eat? I mean, her favorite food. Eat? You now cook? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, you can ask her when she comes over tomorrow. Yeah, sure. All right. Hey, love. Hi, baby. <laughs> Where's Mona? Oh, she's upstairs in her room. Oh, really? Mm. I 
funny. I if Mona wants to go see her dad, please let her go. You know I care for her so much. Of course. And uh, I'm not trying to be a bad stepfather here. Or should I say a wicked stepfather? <laughs> hmm? You know I love her so much. I know. I mean, you are the sweetest, most handsome, caring man I've ever met. And I know that Muna understands that it's just her youthful exuberance. Yeah. She will outgrow it. It's just a phase. Remember, I love you, right? I love you so much. Mm. <laughs> you know something? What? I have something to tell you upstairs. Upstairs? Yeah. Why can't you tell me here? No, no. Um, this particular one is just for your ear alone. So, give me your hand. Uh, no, no, no. You have to tell no, me I'm, here. I'm, I'm no, I'm serious. I'm serious. No, just, you have to tell me here. Uh, okay, <laughs> let, let, me, let me show you. Just give me your hand first. And uh, you make this first move. Oh, leave uh -huh. me alone, Joe. Oh, well, I'm, I'm leaving you alone. Leave me alone, Joe. No, but I'll leave you alone after this. Come here. Mm. You're so beautiful. Oh, thank you. I'm blessed to have you, baby. Me too, babe. So I, I have to go tell you that thing upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Leave me alone. <laughs> so you've made up your mind that you still want to go? Yes, mom. I want to go. You know, we won't judge you if you decide to stay back. You actually made this decision when you were angry. It's okay to stay back. Mom, I really want to be with Dad. I want to spend time with him. I was barely eight years old when you both separated. And ever since then, our relationship has been on and off. And with Gideon in the picture, it's as if our relationship never existed. Don't say that. You'll come back, right? I won't stop loving you, Mom. I just want to spend time with Dad. I will love you less. Okay? <sighs> you see, I'm missing you already. Oh, come on. It's not like I'm <laughs> traveling to space. Hmm? I miss you so much. I miss you too, Mom. And I'm only going there for a week. Eh, don't worry. I'll be back. See, your mind is made up.
You like? You know I don't use toys anymore, right? Yeah. Um, I didn't know how to decorate a teenager's room. I kind of thought that you would, you know. And you know I would only be staying for a week, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to make sure you're comfortable. Come on, hey, sit down, you know. It's, it's a comfortable bed. Orthopedic, you know. <laughs> I just wanted to make up for lost time all the years I've missed with you. And you know... You can't. You can't make up for anything, Dad. When was the last time you saw me? When I was 14. And after Mom got married to Gideon, everything just changed. And you disappeared. I didn't want to... Rock the boat with your mother's new marriage, and your mother and I, we had our own issues. Oh, too. yeah. So you abandoned me then? No, what? Come on, I didn't abandon you, trust me. I want to be in your life every step of the way, but look, you know I love you, right? But you know that, right? Dad, please, I, I don't want to talk about us right now. Please. Okay, I'll just. Go fix something for us to eat, okay? And you can change the space however you want it for yourself to be comfortable. Yes, um, just some few things, hopefully we'll clear it. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm looking at it now. Okay. All right. Listen, let me call you back, okay? All right. Good morning, darling. Hi, Dad. Uh, can I see Uncle Wen? How about I invite him over and we can all have breakfast together? That I just thought I could see him, I mean, since I'm in the neighborhood. Okay, why don't we have breakfast and then you can go and see him? Dad, you, you know he has been good to me, right? And he attended all my birthday functions and he has been there for mom too. Okay, okay at least have breakfast. I'll have breakfast at his place, okay? Mm, please, Dad. All right. Bye. Thank you. Take care. Bye. And do me a favor, come. Could you charge that? I think the, my oh. charger is downstairs. All right, I'll do that. Bye. All right, bye now. of Lagos have been bursting with life since 4.30 a.m. And you're still stuck under your sheets at 8.30 a.m. I don't think Lagos gives a damn about me. Get up! Ah, babe. You have an appointment at 10 with the dentist, remember? I don't feel like it. Stop it now. All right, all right. I'll get up. Come on, don't, babe. Come on. Don't, 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 don't. Just stay with me. Huh? Let's just pretend as if this world does not exist for one day. Just you and me. Wrapped under this shit. Mm. Naked. Mm. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. And then we swing our magic wand and all our bills get taken care of, right? Oh, come on, honey. I'm just saying we should lie down together in mm. bed. Mm. Let's have some you and me okay, time. Stop, stop, stop it. Mm -hmm. You know? Oh, no. <laughs> mm. Stop. stop. Mm. Mm. Damn. I told you, the city is already awake. Get up. 
<sighs> By the way, are you expecting anyone? No. Oh, okay. I'll go see who it is. <clears throat> Better be in the shower by the time I get back. Yes, ma'am. Hey. I love you. I love you too. waiting for you because I wanted us to have a shower together. Mm. Who is it? Muna. Uh, Muna? Muna, come in. Hi, good morning. Hi. Oh, uh, yeah, babe. <clears throat> babe, this Hello. is Muna. She's my goddaughter, Namdi's. Oh, yeah, <laughs> you did mention her. <laughs> oh, it's good to see you. So, um, yeah, we're about to have breakfast. Let's have breakfast together then. <laughs> All right. All right, come, come, come. Thank come. you. This food is really nice. <laughs> Thank you. So, Muna, what's your plan for the week? Nothing really. Do you have any plans for me? Um, I'm pretty sure that your dad has some plans for you. <laughs> You know, like going to see the movies, sightseeing, and all that. Trust me, that man has zero plans. Same old man. Hasn't changed. You should cut that man some slack, you know. He's doing everything possible to make up for all those years. I don't really need him now. I mean, I have you and mom. And I want to thank you so much for always attending my school functions and birthdays. Well, I'm happy that I didn't miss out on any. <laughs> um, so can I invite you over for lunch? I'll be from Dad. Um, Stacy and I, we have something planned later. <laughs> okay, you, you can as well invite her. Just come with her. All right, fine. Um, I'm sure we'll figure something out. Hmm? All right, thank you. <laughs> oh my. I have an important appointment. It's 10.15 already and the appointment is for 10 a.m. I have to rush up. By the way, I'll just drop you off as I'm going, okay? All right, sure. Uh, thank you so much. <laughs> You're welcome. Thanks, baby. <laughs> just dropped me off and um, he said he has an appointment with the doctor and will be seeing me at lunch mm. and yeah, I hope you don't mind I invited him and his fiance for lunch I mean could you believe I didn't know he had a fiance mm. I mean that girl she's just basic not that pretty but she's cool she made breakfast for me <laughs> I found this in your backpack. Is there something else you want to tell me or am I going to keep discovering stuff as we go along? It's not mine. It's not yours. It just magically appeared in your backpack, right? 
it's for my friend. Happy care, my best friend. Your best friend smokes weed. A boyfriend does, and yes, she smokes sometimes. And when they are smoking this, what are you, a spectator? I mean, come on, is that the best you can do? I swear to you, I don't smoke weed, Dad. I mean, I, I know I could be a lot of things, but I don't smoke weed, Dad. Go to your room. Dad! Go to your room. That I swear, that wasn't mine. I don't smoke weed. Really? Well, why should you care anyways? It's not like you're even there for me. I mean, stop pretending like you do care about me. I mean, you know nothing about me. I know everything about you. You're my little girl. My girl who can do no wrong. You're so smart. You're my precious girl. And I know I am not that little princess anymore, Dad. I am not. I am a grown-up lady now, and you should come to the realization that things can never go back to the way it used to be. I shouldn't have come here anyways. Oh no. Oh no. Sit down. Sit down with your daddy. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh. My guy. My man. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> Good to see you, bro. Same here, bro. <laughs> Sparkling as always. We try. <laughs> Stay <laughs> see. <Hi. laughs> How are you, darling? I'm oh, fine. <laughs> Good to see you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah. I bought wine. You brought wine? Yeah. yeah. I have wine, though. Plenty in my house. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How you doing? Mm. Thank you. Ah, Take a seat. Okay. Um, bring two glasses for for them and bring one for yourself as well. Mm. Ah, bro, what you carrying going here? Where is this money that you're hiding? Show Give me the eater, be. Show wait, me the way. Wait, 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 wait a minute. I can't believe this. You can't believe what? So now this compound can be this clean. <laughs> My company is always clean. I just pack the towels. That's a good one. What that's is a good one? This company is always clean. No, no, that's not true. Let me tell you the truth. The reason why his compound is clean is because he has a guest. Ah. That's my daughter. That's our child. Come on. Mm. That can be the reason why I would clean my place. Come on. We know how dirty, dirty, dirty you can be. You. I like to keep things around. Mm. It makes me makes the place look busy. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I believe you. That's all. I mean. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Me first. <laughs> Let's have the lady first. Oh, yeah, certainly. There you go. That's okay. <laughs> Thank All right. You. <sighs> you have your rush of dresses. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> you. <laughs> That's enough for you. Mm. That gets you. <laughs> Cheers to you guys. Yeah, Alright, cheers, cheers to Clean compound. Clean <laughs> And to a good life. Yeah. Amen good to life. that. Mmm. <laughs> this is good wine. You like it? Oh, oh yeah. Can I see it? But you learned this from me, huh? <laughs> I learned from you. Because you never knew about a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> I know what this means. I'm taking more. I... Yeah. You're going to buy, you're going to buy like 10 more. Mm -hmm. My nigga, my man, my nigga, my man. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you, bro. It's good to Always see you. Always good bro. to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. Mm. Been a moment, bro. Mm -hmm. ah, so, how's business, my man? Oh, well, business has been good. So, Stacy, have you finally permanently moved to Lagos or you're still going back to Potako? <gasps> still on the process. It might take a couple of months. But I'll be going back to Port Harcourt in a few days for some documentations. Oh, you, you don't stay in Lagos? For now, no. I just came to visit. <laughs> I have a few more paperwork, so after the marriage, 
everything can now follow. <laughs> Let me go get another wine. We definitely need another one. <laughs> finish this one so. I don't think I'm in. <laughs> no worries. I'm not in. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. That's business, though. I mean. Oh, well, you know, we're thriving. I mean, country ain't easy, but. We always find a way. Country is never easy, man. <coughs> Can everything they worry you? That's it. I don't want you to deal with that bubble. Eh? But that guy is way too old for you now. <laughs> At least. He loves me. Uh, love cute, dear. You, you get bubble. Hmm? Talking about that, I mean, that was why I came to see you. I'm liking someone. I mean, I've always loved him, but I don't know if he loves me too. But he's way older. Age is just a number. Hmm? So, may that one no fear you. You sure? Mm-hmm. But how old is he? He's 40s. But, but I'm not too sure. And he's my dad's friend. Ha! What's he happen? Wahala! See, port when they call care to black. Eh? 40. <laughs> and why this guy don't tell where he tell are you? <laughs> anyway, sha. Nobody say you know if you marry your papa friend. Hmm? Nobody write that one. So it's allowed. Uh, babe, um, this guy get fiance you. Fiance. Mm. That girl won't just spoil my parole, eh? They never marry Nabi. Mm -mm. They never marry. Mm -mm. They go snatch her now. Hey now, babe. I think they babe me for all this is why you don't they follow me the work. I never learn anything. Eh? Shine your eye, go for what you want. Go snatch him. Hmm? Are you sure? Before Uncle. Sure say this thing go work out. Why you no go work out? Trust me. Hey Dad. Where are you coming from, young lady? I went to see a friend. In this neighborhood? No. Do you know how unsafe this country is? I mean, how risky it is returning back that I, at this time of the night. I just went to see a friend. It's not a big deal. I mean, mom lets me do Well, it. I am not your mother. Well, if you're so eager to have me around, then why not ask mom about parenting and how to behave around your daughter? Do you even know my likes or dislikes? My favorite color, my favorite food, none of it. I mean, stop policing me. Hey, watch your tone with me. Go to your room. Go. We need to see tonight. I'll go get my stuff. It's okay, it's okay. Um, I didn't come to take you home. Um, come. Your dad wanted us to meet. Since I didn't want to go to his space, I decided we should meet somewhere neutral. That's why we're here. What for? I don't know. But I assume it's something important. That's why he wanted to talk. Can we already get to the juice of why we are here, please? It's because of me. Dad called you here to complain about me. He found weed in my bag and thought it was mine. 
And ever since then, he's been acting up. And don't I have a right to? Really? Mr. Nandi, I know my daughter. I raised her. And I know what she's capable of. Okay? My daughter is not capable of taking weed. I raised a decent daughter. Perhaps it's her friend. Her friend smokes weed, not my daughter. Oh, and you are okay with her friend smoking weed and your daughter not smoking weed, weed with her, right? I can't believe that you just disrupted my evening for this. Can we talk about this some other time? Because I have important things to attend to. Wow. Babe, are you okay? Yes, Do you need something? Mm -hmm. All right, I'll see you. Take care of yourself, okay? All right, Mom. When um, I, I was hoping I could come over to your place. Yes, mom and dad are fighting again. Please, I, I don't want to be here. I want to leave. Oh, okay, all right. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god, I really had fun. <laughs> so you did. Mm-hmm. Muna, are you okay? Yeah, it's just my parents. I mean, they've been separated for years, but whenever they're in a the room together, it's like the fire just got ignited and wants to burn down the roof. I'm sure they'll be fine. So what about me? Will I? You have grown into a woman. With time, you'll be able to handle situations like this. Thank you so much, Uncle Owen. <laughs> I mean, you've been a great support system to me. I mean, I really wish Dad could just be like you. I mean, you're already my best friend, my, my hero, my everything. <laughs> oh, Mona, you're my goddaughter. <laughs> and Nandi is my friend, so... That makes you kind of my responsibility too. Um, I, I think we should start leaving. Muna. Oh my God. I'm sorry, I, I... What was that for? It's nothing, I, I think I should go. Sorry, sorry. M Muna. Okay, I don't know why they're making you suck. 
<laughs> something, something, huh? Your turn. Let's see what you can do, bro. <laughs> hey! <laughs> At least we know old age hasn't caught up with you. <laughs> Are you thinking about what you're going to do after now? I don't know. I want to spend some time with her. But it looks like when I look at her, I don't look nicer anymore. She's not the Mona we used to know, you know. Our little angel has become something that I can't explain. I wish I didn't stay away. Well, at least now you have another chance to make up for it. Yeah. I really want the best for her. But she would have to make it work. I know you would. Okay. I'll think about it. I trust you. I'm sure that you do a good job. <clears throat> you really need to know. <laughs> Respect yourself. Learn from the prophet yeah, himself. Yeah, 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 yeah. And this one is for your ass. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, do. <laughs> I'll miss you, babe. Yeah, yeah, me too, babe. Oh, it's the Uber guy. I need to go now before I miss my flight. <laughs> All right. Make sure you come soon, okay? Sure. Thank you. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Yeah? Who is it? I'm coming. Muna? Uh, can I come in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come in. Thank you. Come in. What are you doing here? Uh, I came to see you. I thought you were supposed to have returned back to your mother. Oh, no, I'll be extending my stay. Okay, do have a sit. <laughs> Thank you. Has she, has she gone back? Who? Stacy. Oh, yeah. Stacy has gone back to Bohakat. Okay. <clears throat> so, can I cook something for you? You want to cook for me? I mean, yes. Your, your girlfriend is gone, so cook something for you. Uh, thank you very much, but I can cook for myself. Oh, please. Not like a woman. Duh. <laughs> Muna. Why are you really here? I came to see you to, to keep you company. Yeah, but don't you think it would have been better for you to spend that time with your father instead? Oh, so, what about you? I want to be with you. Mona, would you just stay back? St stay back? Why? You don't want me here? Of course, I, I I want you here. I mean, I want you. You're my goddaughter. So is it just because I'm your goddaughter? Or you really want me here? Uh, but just, just stop this, Mona, please. Just stop this. Stop what? M my feelings for you? What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. You know I've always had feelings for you and I know you feel the same way for me. Have you, have you gone crazy or something? 
I've been crazy about you since I was 12. I've always loved your Uncle Owen. I mean, this is absurd for goodness sake. I, no, it's not. It's not. You know, it's true. I've always had feelings for you. I mean, I'm a grown woman now. We can be together. We can, and nobody can stop us. Listen, Mona, at this point, I think you should leave my house. Please. Please. Mona, just go. Please. Just go. Wayne, just, just listen to Mona, me. Mona, please leave. Leave. Yeah, just, just go. Please Thanks for coming. Just, just, just go, please. Yes, hold on. Ah, mame. Hey, you're right. Please come in. Thank you. You right? Yeah, have a seat, bro. Thanks. <clears throat> ah. What do I offer you? No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Um, you sure? Yeah. Mona, she told me that she came here this afternoon. I don't know, she just came home all sad and acting up. Yeah. Anything happen? Yeah, she came. She, she, she came and, uh, well, we had a couple of drinks and we spoke, we talked for a while, and then she left. She didn't tell you, she didn't say anything to you? She didn't tell you she was going to a friend's place or something? No. No, I just assumed she was going home. What's wrong? Did anything happen to her? I don't know. When she came home all moody and sad and locked herself in the room, breaking uh, stuff. I don't know. I, look, I don't want to think that she's doing drugs or anything. Because no, no. No, I, I don't think she's doing drugs. She can't. I mean, Mona can be a little extra, but she's definitely not stupid. Yeah. You know, why don't you come around the house later on? You know? Be good to see a friendly face, help lift the spirit, you know. Right? Yeah, sure. Right. Sure thing, bro. Sure thing. All right. I'll come around. I just went along. But thanks. Though. You sure you don't want anything? No, 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 no. I'm good. I'm good. Right. Take it easy, huh? Yeah. Hey, kiddo. Are you okay? Hi, Dad. What's going on? You know you can talk to me. <laughs> no, I'm okay. I, I just got my period. Okay. Yeah, I, I get really quite sensitive and emotional when I'm on my period. I mean, it's nothing serious, yeah. Yeah. I wish I understood, you know, but... Is there anything I can do to make you feel better? It's fine, Dad. I just, I just want to be left alone. Okay. You know, I can stay here with you and, you know, just keep you company. Dad. I will send... All right, I'll, I'll be in my room, okay? Oh, we could actually go for a ride, you know, have the wind in your face, make you feel good. Dad, I just said I want to be left alone. All right. I'll just go. Or oh, I can call your mom and find out what medication you can take. No, I'll just, just go to my room. I, I just want to help you now. Like I said, that I'm fine. Yeah. It's high time that we told the truth. What truth? Ugochi, you know what I'm talking about. No, I don't. I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? Look, Muna has grown into an adult. Mm -hmm. She's going through some major changes in her life. That's right. If there's ever a right time to tell the truth, now would be that time. Uguchi, you know me. I wouldn't put you in this situation if it was not important. 
And what is so important that you want to ruin everybody's life? If we do not tell everyone the truth, everyone's life will be ruined. I mean, I'm lost like yesterday. <sighs> Are you speaking Spanish or French or English in literature? Because I really do not know what you're talking about. I'm confused. Can you please explain to me on the start? Look. I thought we agreed that we'll take this to our grave. So what are you talking about? You're getting me very anxious. Can you break this in simple English so I can understand? What are you saying? Muna is in love with me. Excuse you? Your daughter has feelings for me. Or so she claims. What are you talking about? Feelings for you? I don't understand. Yes, I am telling you the truth. She came to my place and she tried to kiss me. What? I mean, she kissed me. Hell no. No, you're but, joking. Right? Then she went on, she, she, she was blabbing about um, how she is, how she's, 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 she's always had feelings for me. And she's always been in love with me since she was 12. So in other words, all those times I was trying to be an uncle that was there for you both. The, 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 the birthdays, the, the school functions. She misunderstood everything. And she's always thought that I was in love with her. Oh. That is ridiculous. How, 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 how did we get here? God, oh God. How, like, what, what do we do? I, I don't know. I feel... Listen, if we do not put an end to this right now, we know how this is going to end. As a disaster. Oh. It's understandable. Mona, she's... She's young and she's confused. She thinks she's all grown. So this is the right time to tell the truth. Yeah. I think I took this too far. I mean, what, how do we tell her the truth when she's obviously in love with you? I mean, that's a recipe for disaster. You don't know what she's capable of doing. What about she will hate me? I mean, never talk to me again for life. Well, how did we even get here? Oh. Oh my God. Well, you, know, you know, sometimes <sighs> love grows into obsession. It starts first as feelings and then it becomes an obsession. <sighs> this is the right time to tell her the truth. I mean, she's young, so she doesn't know exactly how she's feeling right now. Just tell me that I'm a terrible mother. I failed my daughter. I failed as a mother. I have failed. <sighs> What do I do? Oh my god. You know exactly the right thing to do. You do. Hey, what are you doing here? Where is Mona? She's in the room. Gideon was here. I mean, but we all agree. It's time for her to go home. What Mona! She wants to spend time with her dad. She needs to go home now. Mona! Why are you so inconsiderate and selfish? You continue to try to keep my daughter away from me. Mom, what are you doing here? Right now, go and grab your stuff. You're going home now. No, I don't want to go with you. I already told your husband that. Do not refer to him like that. He's your father. Hey, Do you hey, understand? Hey, 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 hey. Your listen, stepdad. Hey, listen to me. You can't shove him down her throat, okay? She already has a dad, me. What do you know about being a dad? Do you even know what she's doing under your roof? Do you? What are you talking about? Look, I don't have time for this nonsense. Now, upstairs, go grab your stuff, now! Ah, oh, let go of her! Ah, what is wrong with you? All right, that's fine. Hey, 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 calm down. Where are you going to? Where are you going to? Calm down. Look, darling, you don't have to go anywhere, okay? You can stay here with me. Look, Namdi. I'm doing what is right for our daughter. By forcing her to go with you? Huh? Denying her the love of her own father? 
by doing what you're not capable of doing. Protecting our daughter. Protecting her from whom? Me? I just want her to come home with me, please. What is going on? What are you not telling me? I mean, answer me. What are you not telling me? Do not raise your voice at me. She's my daughter. And I have every right to make the Don't make forget decision that she's my daughter her. too. She's my daughter too. All these years you took her away from me. And I messed up all these years. That's why I, 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 let, it, I let it go. But not anymore. She's my daughter and I have the same right as you do as well. Mom. What is going on? Owen told me everything. Mona, why? Why? What were you thinking? Owen is your uncle. How could you go over there and try to force yourself on him? Whoa! What? How? Like, why would you even feel that way for him? Because I love him. I've always loved him. Lo love who? Shit. Lo love, love who? Uh, no, no. This is wrong. It's completely wrong, he's your uncle. Mom, you don't have the right to tell me who to love. I mean, he's just dad's friend. And we're not even related by blood. He has always been there for me when all you both did was fight every day. Uncle Owen made me feel so comfortable and important. So yes, I fall in love with him. Shut up! Shut, 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 shut. Are you mad? You fall in love with who? What do you know about love? I have the right to choose who I want to be with, and I choose him. No, it's wrong. No, no. After all, you got her pregnant when she was my age. <laughs> this is all your fault. in such a disgusting manner. What are you talking about? You were supposed to be my friend. You are my child's godfather. How could you? I have done nothing wrong. If I ever see you in my house again, I will break everything in your body. Do you understand me? You couldn't even face me. You went to my ex-wife. You're not only disgraced, you are disgusting. And do you have no idea what you're talking about? Who is it? It's Mona. Hi, Uncle Owen. Just can I come in? Mona, go home. Uncle Owen, please, he's, he's going to hurt me. Please, just, just, let me just come in. Mona, I can't help you. You're not even supposed to be here. Just go home. Uncle Owen, please. We, we need to talk about this. Please, let me just come in. Mona, go home. Go home. Please. His name is just coming, please. Ah! What's your phone? Hey. What is wrong? What are you doing now? Huh. Okay. See. 
take some of me for the all right. Hmm? You say I'm going to help you calm down. You will forget everything when they worry you for this life. Hmm? Yeah, take it. Sorry, sorry, because now your first time. Hmm? <coughs> but less sorry, but you gotta help you calm down. Where? Hmm? <coughs> help you relax. Where? Ah. Ah. See my baby. Hey, my baby, don't bad thing. She has to collect it with my hand. Worry, everything will be fine, yeah. Huh? Screaming at her or hitting her is not going to change anything. Well, maybe if you had spanked her or disciplined her when she was young, she would not be uttering such nonsense. <laughs> Father of the century, where were you when I was raising her? You asked me to leave! Yes, I asked you to leave me, not your daughter. So don't stand there and spew nonsense. You better go out there you find my child or I will hurt you. I will hurt you so bad that your toy boy will not recognize you again. Ooh, I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Mm. Owen, jeez. So you are in. I've been knocking. Why didn't you get the door? I had to use my spare key. Owen. Are you okay? What happened? <laughs> Owen, speak to me. What are you holding there? You seem to be in pain. Speak to me. Owen, what's the matter? Stacy, why are you doing this? You asked for the truth. Why all this drama? Why all this drama? Do they ask me why all this drama? How dare you, Owen? I mean, she's just 16 or something. She's older than that. So what? I didn't do anything wrong. She didn't do anything wrong. Really? Owen, this girl is in love with you. She throws herself at you. She gives you, oh my God. I stopped her. I don't have any feelings for her. She's a child. I gave her piggyback rights for goodness sake. This is, this is ridiculous. I guess this child is now in love with you and it is your fault. How is it my fault? You nurtured those feelings in her. A girl doesn't just fall in love with you unless you made her believe that there is room for her. Stacy, please. I I don't know where she is. She came here. I didn't let her in. She, and then she came left. here. You didn't let her in. You heard me. I just said I don't know where she is. Where's my daughter, please? You said she came here, right? So what happened? Where is Muna? Where is she? What do you expect me to say? I don't know where she is. Wait. You said she came here, though. She came here. She was here, but I didn't let her in. So what happened? I don't know. She left. Ah. I need to find my child. She's not answering a phone call. I need her back mm -hmm. here. Do you understand? Like I said, I do not know where Muna is. Oh my God. She's not answering. She's still not answering.
No, Mona, I didn't mean it that way. I didn't. Oh, God. I... I meant well. Guys, I don't know what's going on. Yes, he might have led her on unintentionally, but... I don't think Owen is capable of being a pedophile. I'm worried about him. Namdi. is upstairs. She's so worried about you. When Rosie, did you go? When do you plan to tell Muna the truth? What are you talking about? I don't understand what you're saying. How can you be so selfish? What do you want me to do? I can't. I just can't. You can't or you just don't want to do it? <sighs> Muna is so heartbroken if I should reveal this to her it will break her out I will lose my child my only child I can't afford to lose my child please I can't for goodness sake she's already heartbroken our daughter is going through a particular phase in life and right now what she needs to move past this madness is knowing the truth our daughter what do you mean by our daughter Speak up, Owen! So what's going on here? I guess these two have something they want to tell us. Babe, why are you crying? Where's Mona? What's going on? And where is my daughter? Well, I guess when you hear what those two heartless and wicked conniving humans have to say, you might find it difficult to use the term, my daughter. What are you talking about? Are you guys going to talk or should I continue? Um, Namdi, I hope you find it in your heart to forgive me. Is that your child? What? What do you mean, Mona is not my child? Um. <gasps> Mom, what are you saying? What do you mean she's not my daughter? Ago. Before we we got married, and then we got married. I I found out I was pregnant. I 
I'll explain. Okay? At the time, we're not married, okay? Um, then we, we had a problem that we're separated for like a month. Then I, I, I had an affair with someone else. Then we got back together and we got married. Then I found out that I was pregnant. So, during my full of visit to the hospital, but I, I found out that, you know, the pregnancy didn't quite add up. So, I tried reaching out to the person that I had an affair with to, to let him know that it might not be your pregnancy. But then he denied me. I mean, the affair was when we're not together. Remember when we, when we had that problem? Remember when we're not together? That's when it happened. So, when I reached out to him, he said he didn't want to have anything to do with him, with me. I should go back to the person that gave me the pregnancy. And of course, it was only you that I've been with besides him. So, I decided to just keep it quiet. Then years later, you know, he decided that he was troubled and he just wanted to find out to get it out of his conscience if the child was truly his. That's when we did a DNA test and we found out that mother, mother is not your child. So, but it was late. I mean, it was years later. I mean, how am I going to come back and tell you that, look, I mean, Muna is not your child. You've already believed that she's your child. This was years later. I mean, years had gone by. How do I just wake up and tell you that Muna is not your child? And also, we're also having all these issues. And we just decided to, 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 to bury it. Mom, what are you saying? Hey, can not can be like that? You're joking, Muna. Muna, Muna! Don't you dare come close! Muna, no, you Muna, dare come Muna, close. please, no, 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 please, don't do it. Muna, don't, please. Muna, please. please. Muna, please. I'll kill myself. No, 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 no you no, can't no. do it, please. Mom, no. how could you do this to me? I'm sorry, my baby. How could you keep this from me? How could you? I'm so sorry, my love. It just, as at the time, Uncle Owen and I thought that was the best thing to do. We just wanted to protect you. We just wanted you to be happy and say, please. So all this while, you knew you were my father. And you let me love you. Um, he, he, he only loved you. Like, we all love you. You know, we love you so much. It wasn't anything sexual or intimate, nothing like that. You, you took it the wrong way, please. please. No, he, lo he loved me. He has feelings for me. He does. Do not. I love you very much. And the reason I love you so much is because you are my daughter. Yes, that's all. And it has been a privilege to watch you grow up into a beautiful woman. Please, I beg please. you, don't harm yourself, don't please. Please, please. 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 Don't. It's okay. It's okay. Just, just give it to me. I beg you. Come, come, come. Come. I want to go to the room now. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
do we know that this whole thing is true? I mean, what if she's lying about this? What if she had an affair with someone else? <laughs> Why would I lie? Owen, please. Owen. When Ugochi told me that Mona was my child, I didn't believe it at first. But after a while, I, I got curious. And so we went for a DNA test, which confirmed it. I didn't mean it, honestly. I wish I could turn back the eyes of time. Take this woman out of my house. Nandi, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Before I do something to Honestly, her. I'm sorry. Please, please. I wish I Take can... Take this woman out of my house. Out of my sight right now. I didn't plan it. I'm sorry. I can't stand you. I'm sorry. Get out of my I wish I could. Can actually turn back the hands of Get time? Of I didn't house. mean it. I'm so sorry. Namdi, I'm sorry. Please. Please. Okay. I'll go. I'll go. I'm so sorry. Namdi. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. I don't think you should be here, Owen. You should go home. How do I leave my daughter in that state? <sighs> they don't want you here. Let's go home. I'm sorry, Stacy. Let's go home, Owen. Let's go. Honestly, I can't believe this. Muna tried to kill herself. She got a shock of her life. Hey, God. <sighs> what do you mean? I mean, I... I did what I did. Because I thought it was the best, given the situation, you know? For everyone. We're young. Naive. We made mistakes. How could you say that? You lied to me? You lied to everyone? You lied to your daughter. How can a woman keep such a secret away from her family? You know something? I used to think Namdi did you all shades of wrongs. I was thinking that it was the one that messed up his beautiful family. But you are you are. You are selfish. You are corny. You are deceptive. Very deceptive. Oh, no, no. You cheated on him. You slept with his best friend. You made him train his child. What kind of woman have you? I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. I didn't use to be like this. I didn't use to be like this. 
to be like this, you made me. <laughs> I, I tried. I, I, I loved him, but he, he was like a beast. <laughs> Just about us now, <laughs> or our relationship. <laughs> it's about money. We can't just turn our back on her now. You believe she needs us, right? <laughs> she needs us, right? You believe it? I'm sorry. <laughs> terrible mistake. We kept it as a secret because we never wanted to hurt anybody. And this happened a long time ago when we were both young. Please, don't hate me for this, please. No, when I don't hate you. I just need some time to process this whole thing. I don't think I'm comfortable with you keeping such a huge secret from me. Honey, just let me go. Let please. us talk about this. Let us talk about it, please. Just give me a second chance. I beg you. Honey, please look at me. Babe, I'm on my knees begging you, please. Please, I'm sorry. Honey, please. Please don't leave me. Please. I love you. Please don't leave me. Please. Please, baby. I'm sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Please. Just get up. Get up, Owen. Oh, thanks, baby. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm sorry. Let's go inside. Please. Hey, Dad. What's up? You called me? Yes. Um. Sit down. Sit down. Okay. Listen. Okay, first and foremost, I want to apologize to you. Apologize to me? Yeah. <laughs> You've not done anything wrong, Dad. I have. I was not. I was never there for you and your mom. And that cost us our marriage. See, I was young. I was stupid. It's okay, Dad. I mean, it's all in the past now. And I really want us to go back to how we used to be. And we could create a lot of memories and just make up for the past. I would like that a lot. <laughs> I love and, you, Dad. And I love you too. <laughs> I will love you too. Mm. Till the day I die. Forever. <laughs> what 
What are you doing here? Uh, I asked him to come, Dad. I know what they did to you is unforgivable. But I can't deny the fact that Uncle Owen... Oh, sorry, my dad, or should I say my other dad, has been really good to me since I was a kid. Attended all my school functions. Was there for every of my birthdays. I mean, I can't just hate him now. At least now I know why he did what he did. Because he was my dad. Namdi. I am so sorry. I, I feel really ashamed. You're a good man. And you're a good friend. Can you find a place in your heart to forgive me? It was just a one-time mistake. It was never meant to happen. We were young and we were stupid. And believe me when I say I have regretted it ever since. I wish I could take it all back. Dad, please, for my sake, I need you both. It's going to take a while, you know. Sure, yeah. <laughs> take your time. I'm sorry for what they did to you. I feel terrible as well. I just have this hope knowing that we could all go back to how we used to be. I mean, you both are best of friends. No one is going to take away your daughter from you. She would always be your daughter and nothing is ever going to change that. Uh, okay, let me just get one more glass. <laughs> Listen, why don't you Write your dad, your stepdad, and your mom. And we will have this over dinner. Okay? Thank you, Dad. You're welcome, kiddo. <sighs> okay, so I'll leave you both. I need to get some things at the supermarket. Um, catch up. Hey. everybody's attention <clears throat> yeah. uh, first of all I want to thank you all for coming even though I've been a pain in everybody's ass <laughs> especially my dad and um, I may not have been the best daughter but I'm grateful and blessed that I have three dads and a mom who loves me so much 
and a stepmom, incoming stepmom. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, aren't we a complicated family? Yeah, we are. Yeah. If you say so. <laughs> Thank you for the love, the support, tolerance, and um, I really want us to coexist together as a family for my sake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you're queen bee. <laughs> yes, exactly. I love you all. Love you too, I love you, mom. We love you too. All right, all so right. cheers, guys, yeah, to, to a happy yeah. life. Yeah, <laughs> love you, baby. Love you too, mom. Good. Very good. Very, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Let me know, girl. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Where do I go to? <laughs> no, you have something done, is that? I know, right? Okay. okay. Let me let me see here since this is. But I'll be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But I'll be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago change been through a lot of pain some things are not the same as they were a year ago